One of the greatest challenges in cervical cancer screening is the sensitivity of the pap test. When used alone, the pap test has a relatively low sensitivity, which means that there may be false negative rates even when high-grade squamous dysplasia or cervical cancer is present. Co-testing for high-risk HPV does improve the sensitivity of this test. However, the majority of women who test positive for types 16 and 18 will not develop advanced cervical disease or cervical cancer. Therefore, this type of testing may create a false sense of security or cause unnecessary follow-up. At Path Advantage, we use the FACT test, developed by Cancer Genetics, which looks for the irreversible DNA damage caused by HPV infection. The great thing about this test is that it can be performed on the same collection vial that generated the PAP test and the HPV test, meaning no further collection is necessary. This test uses fluorescent in situ hybridization technology and is currently the only test available that uses four biomarkers commonly associated with progression of cervical disease. Abnormal signal numbers of these biomarkers, 3Q, 5P, 20Q, and Centromere 7, is associated with the increased likelihood of disease progression. Cervical cancer screening can be challenging. Adding the FACT test to the screening process can help guide clinicians in making difficult decisions. Cancer Genetics FACT test, which is also available at Path Advantage, is personalizing medicine and is taking the guesswork out of cervical cancer screening. <laughs>